my name is Iftikhar Arif and currently I'm working with Mullah and Fizz Pakistan it's a, as a general manager in information technology and about Muller and Phipps is a leading distribution company in Pakistan. Uh, with respect to Muller and Phipps, it's it, this is a company where we have the both kind of uh, you know dimensions from vertical growth and the horizontal growth as well. It's a largest distribution company for pharmaceutical. It's a largest distribution company in telecommunication by far. Now we are we have acquired a, uh, the OCS company now turned into an MNP logistic for the last mile deliveries and recently we moved into the e-commerce business as well. So we are planning to design a complete ecosystem where we have uh, the warehousing capacity to the last mile deliveries. Uh, being a distributor, uh, when I joined this company, uh, it was running on AS400 system. Uh, and uh, from the last uh, 13, 14 years, uh, we have bought this company from AS400 to the cloud version. Uh, we have designed our own cloud system, uh, which we claim that's the largest private cloud in Pakistan. And uh, this system serves from end to end, from the manufacturing point of view, the, from to a manufacturing point of view to the last mile deliveries as well. When we talk about 130 billion rupees company, and this year we are we are planning to cross 150 billion. Uh, without having IoT and without having a sensor base, it is really, really difficult to manage all kinds of operations. Uh, last year, we have initiated sensors uh, in our uh, pharma products where we kept and monitoring uh, the temperature controls. Uh, we plug our uh, IoT based devices in our vehicles and in uh, mobile phones through which we can uh, track our riders and uh, the, the delivery men staff in the market. Maybe in the next couple of days, you can see more dependencies on these devices in logistic sectors. A retention of a principal, that's the biggest challenge. Uh, because being a distributor, we always uh, struggle in one thing that uh, we have to ensure all the compliance level. Uh, the, the, the challenges are different. If uh, you talk about uh, the in, in telecommunication, the gray area, the smuggle item are the biggest challenge for the legalized distributors. In pharmaceuticals, the, uh, the copied products are the biggest challenge for the distributors to ensure that uh, they can compete in the market with the real and authentic uh, kind of a products. And uh, for, for in consumer, uh, the, again, the smuggle items are the biggest and key areas. But the one thing is very encouraging that uh, the government is taking seriously and uh, they have placed some very good compliance and uh, policies in the recent past to ensure that the, that the channelized distributors uh, should, uh, you know, place uh, to play their important roles. We started in May. Uh, we started with our own portfolio. Currently, we are carrying around 4,000 products uh, with 52 companies. Uh, you talk about uh, pharmaceuticals, you talk about consumer, you talk about the mainly the renowned uh, telecom products. In, in September, we joined hand with the iShopping and uh, we sold the same kind of a theory. Uh, they gave us uh, five orders in August, um, which, which is around a two or three percent of their contribution. In December, the, the, the portfolio started 153,000 in May and we closed 16.2 million rupees in December. So you can easily imagine the quantum. And currently we are the partners of Hammart and iShopping. Well, um, one thing is very clear that we are not a traditional e-commerce player. When uh, we decide to move into this, uh, uh, in the, in this market, uh, our plan is to serve uh, with our core competencies. Our core competencies are the warehousing and the last mile deliveries. So what we can offer to the, the, the customers or the key uh, players in the market that uh, you just take care of your orders, the rest leave is to us. Currently, the mechanism is that uh, first you generate the order, then you raise the PO, initiate the inventory, sell it, collect it, and then deliver it. Now we are talking about one thing, that you are taking care of the media part, generate the orders, and pass it order to the distributor side for the aptak. 
and we are taking care of the inventory part and we are taking care of the delivery part as well. So it's, it's a kind of a new business where we serve B2B, B2C and C2C as well. Well, uh, one thing is very clear that uh, digital transformation is the future for any kind of a company. We talk about the Kareem, we talk about uh, any uh, telecom player, e-commerce player, whether it's Taraz or AliExpress. Digital transformation definitely will play an important role. Uh, like I said earlier that we are not a traditional uh, kind of uh, e-commerce player. Uh, so it's a connecting dot theory. If someone wants to join hand with us, whether it's an Uber, whether it's a uh, Hummart or any kind of a player, they can definitely uh, avail our expertise. And one important thing that we have designed our own uh, rider systems. For example, if we just uh, consider the coverage area of Mother and Phipps, uh, we started from Gawadar till Gilgit. We have got 125 location. That means after every 100 kilometer, we have a dedicated uh, uh, depot where we have a dedicated field force. So in totality, we have got the largest number of people who are running and serving market on a daily basis. And that will easily transform because when you, uh, when you ask me that uh, uh, Uber and Kareem, it's a limited coverage. They are available in Karachi, Lahore and any metropolitan cities. What about Kotki? What about Timurgara? What about Dadu? So at the, in, in their areas, we are, you know, uh, giving them an opportunity that join us with, uh, with us and uh, market yourself. With respect to Omni One, uh, MNP has another venture that's called a mobile financial services. We have a dedicated mobile financial services in place. Uh, we are uh, through which uh, we can transform our customers from physical cash to the uh, the uh, virtual wallets. Mobile financial service is a, a different kind of a services rather than if you just uh, compare ourselves uh, with Easy Passa. We are the, we are serving as a super agent in the market. We are trying to ensure uh, that the customer has uh, has their wallet and the wallet has the specific amounts. So if you just see the digitalization the, in the near future, currently uh, we are carrying 550 million rupees per day, the float across, and it's all physical. We're planning to float this kind of money through a wallet account, through which we can uh, you know, join hands with all the players like Easy Pesa, Easy Cash, Just Cash, and everyone, Omni. <music> Logistic would remain same in Pakistan and it's the largest and growing business because if you just uh, see the CPAC, CPAC is all about supply chain and logistic and in future the dependency of manufacturing companies, uh, if you just see the trend, they are uh, not uh, growing in a manner that they grew in the last uh, decade. But the distribution side you take all the segment, whether it's a telecommunication, whether it's a pharmaceutical or a consumer, the, the role of distribution is increasing and the dependencies as well.